Hi oh yeah, folks, Demelin here. Uh, I am back in the land of Battlefield 3, uh, playing scavenger mode. I haven't played this that much, so uh, looking forward to get back into it. Uh, you probably noticed a couple of things are different on this video. I now have an intro which I've done myself. That took me about five hours this morning. And in the top left of the screen, you can see uh, Twitter. <laughs> Tells you what my Twitter name is, so if you guys want to uh, add me up, follow me, whatever. Feel free to do so. I'm always happy to talk to people on Twitter. It's easy, quick, and convenient for me. So, uh, you know, back in uh, back in Battlefield, it's been quite a while. I've been playing a bit of COD, played a few other games, played a bit of Mass Effect. Done about three or four hours of that. I've uh, played a couple of other games as well. I've done a little bit of Minecraft, not too much though. And uh, I'm just generally getting back into Battlefield again. I've got my PVR back from my dad, which is cool. So I. We'll be recording lots and lots and lots and lots of videos of that because uh, I absolutely adore this game. It's not quite as fast as Call of Duty games or anything else like that, but I still enjoy it. Anyway, uh, the reason I'm playing scavenger mode is this reminds me of the old school arena style death matches. <laughs> Just because uh, if you're a bit of a younger viewer, you probably won't remember the old school arena matches where you had to run around picky guns up and all the other stuff. Uh, this one's got a little bit of uh, domination thrown in with it as well, which is always cool. Saves uh, saves a lot of running around, plus it gives the target points rather than people going around racking up a huge amount of kills. Uh, I didn't get a huge amount of kills in this. I ended up with 8 kills to 2 deaths, which I don't think is too bad, seeing as this is one of my first games back into Battlefield again. Um, and that's about it for Battlefield for me. <laughs> Uh, moving on to more rumours of the PlayStation 4, apparently in the controllers will it will carry all of your PlayStation Network ID and stuff. So instead of taking your console around your mate's house and having to sign in and get all the internet sorted out, this, that and the other, it basically signs you in with the controller. Although I don't know whether you'll be able to sign in on the same console with two controllers, or whether you'll have to take another console with you. Uh, if I get any more news on that, I will give you guys a shout. Uh, update on the Elder Scrolls Online beta. They're still not handing out invitations just yet. They're still taking applications. I still haven't had my confirmation email that would be sent within 48 hours. That still hasn't turned up. Um, I haven't even got the first one yet, and that was about two or three weeks ago. But uh, other news on Battlefield 3. It's uh, coming up to March. There'll be another DLC coming out then, which is Endgame. It looks bloody smart because they've got motocross and stuff in it. We've, they've actually introduced Capture the Flag as well, which will be an interesting game type, especially for uh, Battlefield. It's very much geared towards domination and conquest, Battlefield 3, so Capture the Flag would be an interesting one. Uh, all depends on the size of the maps. If the maps are too big, it, it could prove a bit of a challenge actually getting the flag from one side of the map to the other. But uh, uh, I know they've brought in a new... They're bringing in a new vehicle, which is like the motorbike. I don't know if they're bringing any more guns in on this one. Uh, I'm sort of hoping they do, because I always like to have new guns and new toys to play with inside the game. And uh, the YouTube community is still down. Uh, apparently that's down to a copyright issue from a rival site. So hopefully Chipmunks and Jokers will be able to get that sorted fairly soon. But if copyright allegations are anything to go on normally it could take a while so fingers crossed that it will be back uh, hopefully it will be back um, obviously keep keep your eyes on Twitter and uh, YouTube and if you have a bit and uh, I'm sure they'll be bringing out some news on that fairly soon so uh, as always guys uh, keep your head down keep gaming and uh, I should see you in the next video and just a quick note before I go Yes, Treyarch, you did fuck up with this Call of Duty. <laughs> so, uh, peace out, guys, and uh, see you later.